We are now at the main view of our program. Every program has one background and an arbitrary number of objects. Just think of a theater play. The background is the stage and every object is an actor. Or imagine a soccer play. The background is the soccer field and the players are the objects. Therefore, every object is unique and it's not possible to give two objects the same name. Because we created an empty program, we don't have an object yet. On the button right, you find the play button, which helps us to test our program anytime. What happens if we tap on this button right now? Exactly! We only see a white screen since we haven't done anything so far. By tapping on back, our program stops and we see the control panel. In the control panel, we can restart our program or if you tap on back, you get back to the main view. This is the structure of pocket code. Now it's time for some action.